This episode was brought to you by our generous patrons. Want to vote on the next game we play? Consider becoming a patron. And we are back. And I'm educating the masses. Uh, <laughs> were we not going to bring the toothbrush over here? <laughs> I feel like I can, uh, if I can get the chalk. You think I, she's going to dress up the chalk? I think the chalk might act like a like a cigar or something like that. Oh, yeah, maybe. No, that's a good idea. That might work. Um, uh, Feels more plausible than a, um, a toothbrush in the mouth. Well, yeah, well. Because I don't know how you would fit it. Drop it. He'll throw it over. Then you can get the fence. Yeah. It's worth a try. Yeah. No, I mean, yeah. I mean, you already have it. And it needs to be something from outside the garden, it said. Uh-huh. <coughs> and yoink. <laughs> Thanks, oh. Dad. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> Thanks for playing catch with me. Yeah, she won't even see it. It's, not, it's like it's not even there. No, I, I, I don't think she cares about it, maybe. Uh, let's get... Uh, uh, let's do the tooth. Let's try the toothbrush back there. Let's see if you she... Left it, left it in the hallway. Yeah, we'll try the toothbrush. I'm just... Well, I mean, because she's going to actively do it in the meantime, too. Yeah. Mm. She has no idea what she she's doing. She has no idea, yeah. She's space casing it out. Uh, seems about right. Uh, did you see um, recently, and, and this is going to be a little dated because... Uh, when this is premiering. By the time this comes out. Yeah, it'll be like um, a week old. On, and recently... <clears throat> Puma, the shoe brand, uh, back down. Oh yeah, Puma, uh, what was, about them? was the... selling uh, gamer shoes. Well, they're like they have a deal with Sonic the Hedgehog. No, but these are like like legit like gamer shoe slippers, socks, slip on thingies. Oh, I mean, I like Puma brand. No, these look slick, but uh, a hundred and eighty dollars. Yeah, and I can see that. Active gaming footwear. Let me let me read for you the product. Created with console gamers in mind, so fuck you, PC Master Race. <laughs> Don't need you. <clears throat> the gaming sock is the first edition active gaming footwear. Is it a sock or is it a shoe? It's a it's a sock with like a well, it's a shoe, but it, you see how it's like a light mesh. Yeah. And so then like they threw in, like a very th a thin sole. It's like a driving shoe, a kind of. Or like so a, it's very thin. Or like so you, slippers. Kind of, yeah, much much like that. I think it's even a little thinner, but because it's active wear. Um, oh, you got to get that before she. You got to put it in the in the uh, dish. I'm, I'm not doing anything. Not to fish the dish. Dope, 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 Created with console gamers in mind, the gaming sock is the first act, uh, first edition active gaming footwear designed uh -huh. for indoor eh. and in arena use. It hmm. delivers seamless comfort, support, and grip so gamers can adapt to different active gaming modes and hmm. game their best. Features and benefits, medial wrap-up grip in seek mode, lateral wrap-up support in attack mode, heel wrap-up stability in cruise and defense mode. Huh. Fucking, these are shoes! She's gonna put it in his mouth, isn't it? He doesn't have a mouth. Uh, she's looking at it. Yep. Well, <laughs> there we go. I don't think that's how that works, but sure. Sure, why not? Now we gotta get him a hat. Yeah, we do. Well, I know where the hats are. Yep. I just. Oh, I, sorry, ma'am. I, I, I didn't mean to. I didn't mean. Oh, I'm sorry. That's. The, oh, I didn't. Oh. There's nothing to do with this package. I wonder if I could deliver it. I mean, it was delivered. Oh, we to didn't check up here. Doorstep. Swap their mail. <laughs> That's fucking do, do, rude. Do, 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 Can do, you put do. it in the mail slot? I hope so. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> It's your past due notice. <laughs> Pay your bills. <laughs> oh man, um, I just I think it's it's fucking ridiculous. No, it, it, I mean it's super ridiculous. But it's made <clears> in <throat> for like high end people that want a nice shoe. It looks comfortable, and Puma makes good stuff. But Nothing, I would, it does look comfortable. I want to pay one hundred fifty dollars for a pair of slippers. I paid twenty. It's one hundred and eighty. Okay, one hundred eighty dollars <laughs> for a pair of slippers. I, at least I guess you could rest assured that they would last a long time because they're not going to get dirty, right? Is this still the price? No, no, yeah, yeah. exactly. One hundred eighty, way too much still. No, obviously, uh, no, you need thanks. to you need to take that box and bring it over to the uh, garden. Okay. Um. Yeah, absolutely. I need to take this. One hundred eighty. Yep. You need to take that box and bring it back over to the garden. I'm not letting go. How do I? I think you have to get her to walk back. Okay. No, 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 put it in there. Oh, she okay, put cool. It right there. You have to wait for her to like go yeah. do a delivery or okay. something. I'm just gonna. Or maybe What's wrong? you can close her door, right? Eh. <laughs> oh, she kicks you. I'd say close the door and then go for the box, maybe. Ha ha! 
Oh, <laughs> who did you, that? <laughs> um, yeah, I wouldn't pay $180 for shoes. Like, mm. well, th th one, I can't afford that. Uh, two, uh, no, I mean, I, ha I, I will take that back. It depends on the shoe. I've, I've never paid more than $40 paid, for a pair of shoes. I paid $220 for a pair of boots, but these were boots that I needed for work. Boots are like... And and they're, they were real leather boots that I needed for uh, to meet like uh, industry standards for electrical voltage resistance, mm -hmm. slip resistance, all this other stuff. And the, other, the next cheapest one was like $120, and they were really off-brand, and they hurt. And I'm like, I'm not paying $120 for an off-brand. Plus, yeah, no my way. company helped a little bit for uh, paying for some of them. And I still have those boots. Oh, yeah. And I still wear them five years later. Well, also... You, so they were they were well worth it. Yeah, they're well worth the investment, and not to mention... And they're still you're not, safety toe and you're everything not like gonna, that. Steel shank and everything. Yeah, you're not going to outgrow a pair of boots. Well, I'm, yeah, I'm pretty pretty yeah. much where I'm at right now. You, you'll wear them <laughs> Still waiting out. for my growth spurt. Um, but that's about it, and you don't wear but, them enough now to ever probably wear them out. No, and if I ever did, they're resolable. Oh, So I damn. can get them resold for, like, 60 bucks or something like that. Okay. And when I when I say resold, I mean, like, they do the whole uh, shank and everything inside. So it's like, oh, Not perfect. That way. Where's the... Oh, I gotta go through that. Ooh. You gotta go, yeah, back through the uh, garden. Uh, I can't go back through the garden that way. I have to take the box and go the long way. Oh, no, that's just the water. Yeah. Whoa, 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 it's gonna get wet. That's fine. It, it's a sailboat. Uh, do, I, do. I guess it is. Yeah, this is the this is the difficulty. I gotta take it all. I thought it was gonna get ruined. Nah, it's fine. The cardboard will dry. Yeah. I, uh,. God, 180 for some slippers though sounds a, a bit. It much. sounds a bit insane. Um, I'm trying to think if I've ever spent that much on apparel. The most I've ever spent on anything is a suit. No, well, yeah, yeah. Well, that's, that's, ex that's that's accepted. About, that's about it. Yeah. Um, the, which uh, I'll have to get that tailored again because now that I've lost like 20 pounds, it's like pfft, maybe I can actually fit into my jacket. Yeah. <laughs> it's not a bad thing. Like I needed to tailor them before to get them a little bit tighter, but now that I've lost like 20 more pounds since then, and I already wasn't heavy then, it's like ah, oh, I should probably do that next time I need to. But it was a nice suit. And I got it for a really good deal. Yeah. <laughs> I've got some nice dress shirts and some and some. Um, in a suit and stuff like that too, um, but yeah, I think my I think my most expensive piece was like my Red Wing boots. Mm, yeah, I would say so. Oh. oh, there you go, there. Yeah, and I I love them. I love them so much that whenever I had to get a new pair after like a year or two, um, because yes, yeah, some of them got worn out because mm -hmm. I worked on boats with non-skid and they would tear up the soles and everything. Here and eventually, go. the say, the steel toe would just pop Boy, out. And they're like, oh, it. that's not. That's not viable anymore. You're going to need to get a new pair. That blows. I remember my dad had boots uh, all like when he was, because he was an iron worker. Mm -hmm. And I just see them in the corner this after a certain time, like seeing his old worn out boots, like, damn, the work that he must do has got to be insane. Oh, yeah. It's t it's crazy. On I used to go through pants like crazy. I, I That's another thing. I'd, I'd get a, I'd have to get $80 like uh, pants because they were. Um, Otherwise, they'd just rip. They were fireman hose like material. Double, double thick in the knees and stuff like that, uh, uh, and you could slide in uh, knee pads and stuff into them because mm. it was so it was so hard on the knees and everything. You had to. My dad that, had to do the same oh, thing yeah, as an iron would, worker. I I would get uh I would get sc scratches and cut and scuffs and stuff like that on my knees even with knee pads because you're out on a boat deck and you're trying to like move line along or you're or you're towing around uh, a bunch of vinyl boom and things like that for oil response. It's like. Yeah, you you don't go cheap on your equipment because that could end up no. hurting you, um, or causing you to get hurt. You know, I've had shit cut through my pants and stuff before. There's a certain point of when you become an adult, like it's worth it to pay the extra amount of money to make sure that your equipment's not gonna screw up on you. Yeah, your equipment screws up on you, you're in for a world of hurt. Right. Or <laughs> in a, in a job that's like heavy industry like that, it's like, or at worst, oh, do, 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 do. Uh, you get ah. injured and then you're get off the job and it's like oh that's not acceptable so you're gonna take it from him once he falls to the ground yeah take his hat take his hat yeah <laughs> now i really look like donald with this blue cap <laughs> does donald have a blue cap i guess he does huh yeah he's with like a little the little, the little uh the little ribbon on it mm -hmm. um 
And Donald has a little red bow, too. Yeah, he does. I almost look like Donald. Donald. My hero. Not, not the Donald that's uh, <laughs> political, but Donald Duck. Just, just to let people know, Donald Duck is my hero. <laughs> uh... Okay, I think I can get over... I got to go back this way. I've, I'm kind of lost at this section, but I think, yeah, you're right. I've got an idea. Because you can get it wet, right? Yeah. I can hold on to it, too. Yeah. I'm glorious. Quack, 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 quack. <laughs> Who quacked? Who, Who did, did that? that? <laughs> Was it you, Hat? I don't believe you. <laughs> I'm taking you to Jurors Prudence for a trial. The trial of the quacking hat. <laughs> We will Perfect. bring the defendants up, and they will question your quackiness. <laughs> Where were you on the quacking quack of Quackertons? Where's Daffy? Where'd you hide him? <laughs> Where's Plucky? Release the goose. Release the geese. Oh, man. They, uh... They, uh... They, uh... Oh, I was gonna say, uh, I haven't, I haven't seen geese in a long time, and this game is reminding me of, like, all the times I have seen geese, and they're... There's dicks! You know, I haven't ran into geese that much, but I do love regular shows take on geese. What, what are they like? They're dicks. <laughs> They're just dickheads? Yeah, remember the little ducks like form like giant robots? Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. The five ducks. Because they have to ducks. fight the geese. Bunch of baby ducks. Send them to, to the, the moon. moon. <laughs> Perfect. Why would you send it to the moon? Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I, I remember that vaguely. I um, love regular show. I need to watch more regular show, man. Regular show is one of the few shows that just stays good all the way through. For as long as it did, too. It was like five, six seasons. I thought people didn't like it as much once uh, the Red Robin or whatever was kind of put in the back burner. Uh, the, I female, think it, the female I honestly bird. I think it's still just as good. Well, I think I, it, I'm I not think, saying it's bad, but... Yeah. There you go. I was like, that didn't work. It feels very true to life. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. It's honestly one of the better, like, oh, yeah, this is how life actually works. Oh, God. To, like, friends or other bullshit. We just need the last flower. Nice. And then I think we can call that good. Is that... that that should be it. That is it. And then the rest is just time trial. I'm not going to do time trial. No, I, I wouldn't mind doing I, it. I already but... personally know what we get to, so I was like, eh. Yeah. Wait. Eh. Uh, I got to deliver this letter, though. <laughs> Hold on. And yeah, wait, what, I was going to say, what happens if you go all the... No, what? that's a long way around. It is a long way yeah. around. It's not that long. I'm, I'm curious. That's not even the right house, though. Yeah, I know, but I want to deliver the wrong mail and send them into jail for, you know... <laughs> I'm that just kind of goose. They're not going to... They're going to open someone's mail illegally. I've done that. And then, the, yeah. <laughs> I, wonder, I wonder whose mail you could have opened illegally. Uh, the one that was delivered to my house and has been delivered to my house on an annual basis for as many years as we've been living here. Yeah, you mean the two people that have never changed their address? Yep. Yeah. Sorry. Sorry, Jean and Alicia. Yeah. The... <laughs> I Change think those are their names. I don't remember. But I think, they, I think it's we Gene them, and Alicia. We get them all the time. Oh, we st I still get, like, magazines every now and then from them. But the weird thing is, I'll get, like, one. Right. It's not even or, a lot. Or I'll get, um, I'll get, like, notices for bills and stuff like that. And I'm like, wait, they haven't even lived here for six years. Like, what, what is going on? So I'll, I'll just throw it away because I'm like, I'm not forwarding this. I don't know where they live. Why would they, who, Why even bother? They obviously don't care. Yeah. Um, for, but for firewood. Re recently we just got uh, one of their kids, uh, not one of their kids, but someone's... Someone's kids? Uh, someone's kids of family or friends that they know, uh, Christmas card. <laughs> we get at least one or two Christmas just, cards. Just start putting it, adding into the thing. Every you, year. But here's, here's the thing. Mail. It's from out of state. Oh, God. Ow. Oh, jeez. Oof. It's from out of state. We're not going to go send it. <laughs> We're not going to go send it back. Yes. Just take your shit, too. <laughs> Uh, yes, that was so worth it. We're kind of, uh, we're not going to send it back. Like, not like that. <laughs> so I'm just like, eh, garbage. Like, oh, sorry. I was not prepared. <laughs> um, one time they, one time they, uh. That means someone thought that through. They're like, you know what? I want someone to pick up this mail. Well, she, well, she probably, she probably does it for anything that's not hers that, uh, goes into the house. Okay, maybe, but still. Uh, I'm, I'm thoroughly cause, impressed. Because think about it. They do that with the guy on the, uh, the fence. Anything that's not from his yard, he throws over the fence. Um, very nice. Uh, one time they had... <laughs> one time they had a, uh, a baby's... A baby's... Uh, not a stroller, but a... Uh, 
baby carrier, like a, like a car seat, uh -huh. uh, delivered to the house. And oh, it's wow. like, wait, you guys haven't lived here in like three, four years at the time. How did you have it misdelivered to the right house? How do I get over here? I gotta wait for her to open. I think right? yeah. Well, you can go underneath. Uh, Remember? Oh, you can go right. You can go to left. Yeah, I forgot that uh, was a thing. So I tried to get it returned. I called up the company because there was no return address. It was direct shipped from the uh, company. So I called huh. up the company and I was like, "Hey, they don't live here. Is there anything I can do?" Oh, that, oh I, I forgot. Just to open that. <laughs> Is there anything I can do to get this returned to them? And they're like, "Well, we're not going to give you their address." And I was like, "Fuck!" The one chance I could of like to have oh, things returned to them, in? they didn't give it to me. But uh, do we go to the bridge? I did. Uh, I did, That's right. I did ask them if I could get them to uh, come Mail and it pick back. it back up, and they were like, "Oh no, just keep it. We'll we'll make sure that they get but it." But I don't have a child. There's the flower. There's yeah. the flower right there. I was hoping to find a way to open the gate, but this will be fine. I can yeah. just go this way. Yeah, I'll just um, uh, just don't make my way out there. Oh, you look so majestic. I am so beautiful. <laughs> Oh, mon chéri. Oh, they should take me to the beauty pageant. Look at this gorgeous <laughs> duck. Um, I mean, geese, goose. But to this day, I still have not been able to get their address so I can return anything to them. Because it's yeah. all addressed to the house. It's like, but <laughs> how do I? We could have, have a baby. We could have a baby bonfire. We could just take uh, the baby carriage and just. Oh, I, I usually, uh, if it looks like sensitive material, I'll burn it. Yeah. Um, because we're courteous like that. Well, yeah, because I'm like, I would want the same. Also, done to we me. don't want to get in trouble for having their confidential mail. I so would, we'll just... I would, I would want the same done for me. Yeah. But I can't forward it, so I'm like, what do I do with it? Do I keep it and have it possibly go into wrong hands? No, I'm like, I'm destroying it. And is that the right thing to do? Probably not. But Probably not. I don't know any better, so. We did it! We collected we did everything! It. Minus doing the time trials, which we will not do. Wait, we did everything, right? We did everything. Uh, That's, all That's all done. That's all done. Why don't do, they do, cross do. out in the basket on the flowers? I don't know. That's a weird... In the basket over by the well. Which we did. Yeah. Huh. Oh, well. Oh, well. I guess I am the king of the geese. Well, you would be if you did the time trials, but I am the queen of the geese. <laughs> well, you could also be, but you'd be the monarch of the geese, but the landlord of the geese. <laughs> what, whatever it would be, whatever a goose would be crowned as. I am the king of this town. Everyone bows before me. <laughs> guys, gals, thank you guys for voting on this, uh, patrons. Yeah, thank you so much. This was a lot of fun. This was a lot of fun for this game. Yeah. Um, I'm glad we got to play it, and I figured you would love to be the goose. I, I, since, I, you're, I, since you're very ducky. I am a very duck fan, and also it brings out the younger brother in me. It's like, <laughs> how do I fuck with people? If, if, I, don't, I don't get to do that that often anymore. <laughs> if you guys want to vote on the next game that we play... Uh, consider becoming a patron, please. Yeah. Uh, Sam also does the illustrations for the Couchlings. Mm -hmm. That's what you guys see every other week for the speed yep, paints. And I'm working on one right now or right now. I did the sketch. Well, I just um, need yeah. to finish it. Yeah. So uh, if you guys want one, consider supporting us. Yeah. It, it helps out with paying for all these nice new mics it, and everything It like has that. made the world of difference. The quality of the mics, everything that we're able to do is because of you guys. Thank you guys so much. We will see you later. Maybe on Switch. Maybe on Twitch. Maybe on Discord. Maybe on other places. Links in description for all every all of that. Hong Kong <laughs> couchlings. Beep bop boo. No one can have these flowers. Just well them. I'm gonna lay one out for uh, the flowers we lost <laughs> in this say, event. Put put it on the picnic blanket and lay down next to it. Draw me like one of your foul girls. <laughs> <laughs> Be free, little foul. Be free. Oh, it's just, it just goes right to the edge of the water and Dang stops. Dang it! Physics. 